Businesses were forced to make many changes over the last year of the pandemic. And that includes Famous Dave's, the barbecue chain that was started by Famous Dave Anderson. They started up their first restaurant in Hayward, Wisconsin. So we have Jeff Cravello, CEO of Famous Dave's, joining us live this morning on Skype. Jeff, thanks for being with us today. Thank you, my pleasure. So let's go back a year ago. Uh, your restaurants, like everyone, had to shut down at the time. Uh, what did that mean for Famous Dave's? Well, as I like to say, when you get hit in the face with a pie, you tend to act and react much different and much faster than you normally would. So we had to immediately begin innovating. And to do that, we opened 15 ghost restaurants, seven of which are in our Granite City restaurant. We developed two virtual concepts, one a typical concept and the other uh, is to soon be announced. We converted our restaurants using our to-go counter uh, to counter serve models. We added a Famous Dave's restaurant to the Texas T-Bone Steakhouse restaurants in Colorado Springs. We bought the Real Urban Barbecue uh, concept in Vernon Hills, Illinois. And from that, we developed a whole new Famous Dave's. And how did those changes help you once things were partially able to reopen? All right, so again, all of that evolution and that innovation um, allowed us to continue to operate Famous Dave's as we did prior to the pandemic. Um, barbecue travels very well. People right. love it, it's a comfort food. And a lot of the things that we learned during the pandemic, we'll continue to use uh, even post pandemic. D uh, Jeff, this is incredible because during the pandemic, a lot of restaurants really suffered, but for you, it looks like it's just grow, grow, grow right now. Yep. Yes, we, we took the opportunity to expand um, and, and I'd like to say all of those things that we did to innovate, it was with the goal of delivering and serving uh, America's favorite barbecue to as many people as possible. And so many restaurants uh, unfortunately closed and it was a very frustrating time for restaurants. We chose to fight, we chose to evolve, we chose to innovate as quickly as, as possible, uh, knowing that the light at the end of the tunnel would come and a new dawn would happen. And, and here we are, we think we're coming out of this evolution, uh, new innovation. And what is next? What do you hope for next as we navigate life slowly coming out of this pandemic? Well, certainly life has changed and um, we think customers want high quality food without all the traditional steps of service. We call this uh, efficiency and we call it the next evolution of famous days. One of the things that we did was we, we developed the line serve concept that I mentioned, then we also developed a line surf concept with a drive through. And so these are the things that we'll be building and, and continuing to roll out. And it's so interesting to see how restaurants had to get creative to reach and connect with their customers at a time like now. Yeah. Jeff, thank you so much for joining us for that take on how Famous Dave's has navigated the last few months and what the next few months look like as we make our way out of this pandemic. Jeff, thanks so much. Of course, Riley. <laughs>